So the boy down work posted this clip on Twitter today, man, and he's talking about the acrobat badge and the power of the acrobat badge. Look at him go in there, somebody jumps, he goes up, changes around, and he scores the bucket. Now, my boy Hezzy, who innovated the jump shot that we had on yesterday, he was talking about the acrobat badge too and how strong this badge is. I was like, Hezzy, come on, man, that's bull. He was like, yo, you can really, nah, I'm, he's like, no bullshit, you can really go to the rim, and anytime somebody challenges you, you just switch it up, and then you can, you can change it up, and 99% of the time, you're gonna hit it if you got Acrobat on at least silver or whatever. And I was like, come on, bro, you got to be kidding. Then I went out there and looked up some, uh, looked up some people playing with Acrobat, and I mean, it, it's it's almost insane, the stuff that you can do with, let me start this one back over from the, from the jump, man. Like, like, just watch my guy. Go to, I want y'all to see him go to the rim and change it up. Bro, why, why won't they let me play it from the beginning? Do I gotta refresh the page, man? Come on, we trying to see the act, there we go. Bro, it, it, it still won't let you see it from the beginning. Anyway, there was a nice acrobat joint right there. Oh my God, he just broke his ankle and then he get acrobat. If that happens to me, I'm turning the game off and I'm, 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 I gotta I gotta figure out where you get. Look at this, on three people, he's going in there with acrobat. And he's like, you aren't using acrobat right on NBA 2K23. And this is uh this OTF Kami. I, I, I wonder if you see Kami's lookout. But anyway, I just was looking at this and I was like, well, we know what, what bad, what downward was doing wasn't in competition, but this is in competition. So I want to know how many of y'all use the Acrobat Bash? How many of y'all know how strong it is? And like, what's the best way to trigger it? Because I know, and then we got one more, we got one more for y'all too. I know that you can go to the rim and some people use it where they, where they're going they hold, uh, they're holding the right stick up or whatever, then you can come down with it and then that'll change it. Some people go up with the right stick and then hurry up and hit X or whatever like that. So there's many ways to trigger it. Some people go up with X and then they hit X again and, and change it up. But I wanna know, do you guys use the Acrobat badge? Did you know it was this strong? And um, and how, how do you trigger it? And you know what else is that strong? Each and every the, the VC prices are that strong. So each and every Friday, we give away $50 in VC. Today, right after this video, we're gonna be doing the stream, or we're probably doing the stream right now as you're watching the video. We're gonna be giving away $50 in VC, $50 in Cash App, or I'm gonna buy you a copy of a video game. Call of Duty just came out. If you don't have Call of Duty, you can get that today. So make sure y'all like the video and comment Acrobat at the end of your, uh, at the end of your comment for your chance to win. Also, we're trying to give away some money, man. Look, this is what we're gonna do. I'm up in the ante. I said if we got 10K views last month, we're gonna give away uh, a next gen console, but a lot of people, we didn't make that. We made it 8.5. So I'm gonna put the cap underneath 8.5 and I'm gonna put it at eight. If we average 8K views per video this uh, this month, we're gonna give away a next gen console. It can be an Xbox, it can be a PlayStation 5, I can buy you a laptop, or you can just get like $500 cash or something like that, man. So I'm incentivizing y'all. All y'all gotta do, like the video. Comment the daily word down below, which is Acrobat. Put that in hashtag Acrobat at the end of your uh, comment. Find a funny way to put it in or whatever. And the more videos y'all like and comment on, the better your chances because we choose from a random video. Thirdly, the bots are still in the videos. But make sure y'all don't pay them guys no attention. It's only me. I don't got Telegram. I'm not putting my phone number in there. And it certainly doesn't start with 888, all right? So look, I I'm not doing that. Make sure y'all protect yourselves. Don't respond to the bots. Um, I only got Instagram, Twitter, and Black Planet. And with all that out of the way, good morning out there in 2K land, man. Check it out, that boy Power DF, he just started off with, don't compromise your standards or values for anybody. Looks like he's on a, uh, on a different road to growth. A lot of people still have an issue with, you know, the whole DF clan breakup thing. I feel like people can change. I feel like people can grow. You, you, I don't hold people to standards that they were when they were younger because you certainly, if you held me to the standard that I was when I was 20, like 25, years ago i'm old i'm really old but 25 years ago when i was 20 if you held me to that standard then you 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 would think i was a reprehensible human being so i believe people can grow uh, as long as they ain't done nothing to hurt nobody and you know they haven't com committed something of moral turpitude or anything like that i think people can always get over it uh up what y'all think up next we got we got the boy uh cold coves uh he says there's some people who genuinely want to see you win and others are going, I mean, are good at faking it. So like, yeah, you got some people like Brute, he really want to see your boy win. And then you got people that come around and stuff and they just really want to try to be around 
you know, for a round around. Some people really don't want to see you win. They just want to fake it. We got Brute and Gambit. We've been running together forever. I can tell people like Hezzy, Birch, all the guys that just came, you know, that, that we start playing with this new Big Mac, uh, Dre be cool. I mean, you know, somebody cool to Dre. I can't call everybody's name. I can tell all the people that want to see us win. But there's a lot of people that have come along in the years, and they they really they really was just trying to run along for the ride. They'll play with us for a few games, think something's gonna happen. Then you know, kind of mention, oh yeah, I'm you know I be streaming too and stuff like that. Now I ain't got no problem with nobody mentioning it. Like I'm, I be trying to, I'm actually trying to promote Perks. I'm trying to get him to you know pay him to edit some of these videos for me so we can get him on the editing scene and get that man popping. But you know, uh, like because I can understand that that you know he one of them people. He don't want people to know what he do because he don't want people to think that's what what he around for. But promote yourself, baby. Promote yourself. I'm gonna promote him for it. If y'all need some videos edited, hit me up and I'm going to hit up Birch and we're going to try to hook y'all up. Now as prices, I don't know what they is, but you know, y'all can negotiate that. I'm going to negotiate my own prices. 15 cents per video. That's what I'm trying. Now I'm just joking, man. But yo, you know, like I said, I know some people want to really see you win and they really rock with you. Like I said, Hesitant gave me several jump shots. All the, all, like, all the guys they run, we was playing Call of Duty yesterday, having a blast, Little Birch, Big Birch, everybody that they run with, those are a bunch of genuine guys, Shakedown, genuine guys, D-Man, UNT, all, you know, a lot of people genuine guys, but like I said, uh, even my guy Dynamic, super genuine, a everybody, Anonymous, uh, T-Miz, AKA the Instant Burner, Big Papa Verde, all them guys, OG Constant, everybody, they, all these guys, Genuine people that really want to see you win. I can't name everybody because there's too many of them. But and and and, and the haters are too far and in between. You know, like uh, even Quavo, Quavo, all them guys. They want to see Nike. I rock with him. He wanted my guy. All them guys. They want to see people win. Um, uh, I can't forget him, man. But we gonna talk about him in a second. But uh, delayed first 48. All them guys. They real, real, real individuals. Even my guy. Forget that TV that plays uh, Apex. You know what I'm saying? He be coming through the stream rocking with me. He don't even play 2K, so there's a lot of people, too many to name, but that's how it should be. You should be able to name everybody that wants to see you win, and, and we don't even worry about the haters because we can't, we, we, you know, they don't contribute nothing to value, so we don't even know who they are. Hey, the dude, the dude Luck says prayers if you're returning to NBA 2K 22 and 21. Bro, I can see people going back to 21 before I can see them going back to 22. At least on 21, you can get some bumps and play some semblance of defense. On 22, it ain't happening, baby. That boy, uh, Chuante says, people never went back to track and played the old 2K this fast. Um, 2K 12. I think they went back to 11. Like, I think we really bought that game and said, yep, I already played 2K11. I'm going to go back to 2K11. I don't think anybody really played it that long, but, you know, um, that's that, I, I don't know. That's just my opinion on that one, man. Hey, they, they, the boy, look, uh, he says, do you still play 2K23, yes or no? Uh... Oh yeah, I got a, I got a, I got a, uh, another person want to see me win. Big Boy Thunder. He 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 always rock with the videos. He watched the first 15 seconds and then he dipped. So you know, and my boy Juice and Ramp, all them guys, man. Uh, Sight the Jedi always in the comment section. And y'all know if y'all always down there. And my the binary state of mind too, man. Come on, it's too many people to name, baby. Y'all know what I'm talking about. He said, Do you still play 2K23? Yes or no? I haven't. I haven't uh, much. Uh, I haven't played much recently, but I'm about to go back into it soon and like i said i've been playing too man i've been playing i've been rocking with this joint man and uh it's it's a dope it's a dope joint man uh I, I like the video a lot of people i mean i like the video game a lot of people don't like the video game it is what it is i feel like i feel like if you don't like it and you can't adapt then that's just on you call of duty changed up a lot of people don't like it a lot of people don't like it because they played it one way for years and they don't adapt they couldn't adapt People used to look at my running numbers in Call of Duty and say, this guy never stops running. He never stops running. I ran more than anybody in the history of Call of Duty. Literally, you can go look up the numbers of Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. Never stopped running, like ran miles and miles in that game. This game, you can't run. I had to slow down. I slowed down, adjusted, and I'm having a blast. Instead of just trying to make the game what I want it to be, I'm adapting to what the game is. And hey, that's where I am with it. Hey, that boy Flock with the with the funniest boy. That now the funny section of the video. That boy Flock says no November is just like the rest of the year. For most of y'all, and he got easy there. <laughs> Not for me. I already failed that one. But you know what it is, man. A lot of people be talking about that stuff, man. I don't participate in none of that. I don't participate in no shave or no or no November. So y'all got that one, boy. But some of y'all got it involuntarily. <laughs> yeah. Not me though. If you think I got it involuntarily, shut the fuck up. Shut the. Fuck 
Fuck up. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I'm not. That's one challenge I fail the first day of, and I will never entertain it or be in it, man. Y'all know what it is, man. Speaking of challenges, no nothing of it. Boy, that boy delay is hilarious, bro. I woke up to this, and they was talking about, like, Steph. I don't know why Steph posted this, but we were just laughing. But this dude hilarious. Just look at this, man. If you subscribe to my OnlyFans for $4.99, this ain't the only gun you'll see. <laughs> bro, Delay, what did you do? <laughs> I don't know the context. All I know is Nike was saying that this joint was hilarious, and that's how it was. But this is how the internet and being funny always. We talk about people that see you want to win. He says, I'm really a funny dude. Even the ops repost me. That's gangster. And then down, down. <laughs> <laughs> Downward, like I remember that joint. And then Nike was like, it's a video game. We can never be ops over the internet. And then, um, and then, so, uh, first of all, uh, uh, what's the name say? That's true. And then, um, then Nike says, I really don't got a problem with you, honestly. We could be out there taking dudes VC, no cap. And then, hey, what's the name said? Hey, he said, say less. Uh, say less. Real dudes gotta know when to let dumb stuff go. Congrats on your partnership. Keep grinding. Yeah, we can run. Just, just, uh, you know, just rock with me. And of course, I put out there. I had to put. I had to had to add on to it. I can't wait for to see my guy sell both of y'all at the same time. Y'all already know it. I love it. Now, the, hey, uh, coming down to the end, man. We got the boy Zach said. If you're trying to come up in the 2K community, please don't just copy what everybody else does. Um, else is doing and think outside the box a little. I, I uh, and one person says, it depends, it depends. You can just start off uh, with created videos. Uh, it depends, you can't just start off with created videos because nine times out of 10, I, I don't I, I don't know why, but it doesn't work. Start off with a few meta vids, but add your own sauce. And then once you establish, you know, you establish do creative vids. And that is the exact take. Because anybody that says don't do it, everybody that says they do, you know what I'm gonna tell them? Shut the f up. Shut the f up. How can I get people into the channel if I'm not doing what is being successful for everybody else? Like, that's what, I, I, I'm not saying that Zach doing that, but I understand that he's already up there and he doing his thing, but nah, it, it don't work like that, brother. You got to do what everybody else is doing first. Put your own spin on it, put your own flavor. And then, like, I can do news and I can do some jump shot videos and I can do this and that. Then I hit y'all with Raging with Randoms. Then I hit y'all, you know what I'm saying? Then I hit y'all with the board. With the, with the writing on the board and stuff like that. Nobody else doing no stuff like that. But people don't even really watch them videos and stuff like that because I don't have a big enough audience yet. But then I hit y'all with the breakdowns and stuff like that. That's how you gotta, that's how you're gonna be the most successful. You gotta start off with the meta stuff. You get people drawn in, do your own flavor, get them drawn into your personality. And then once you draw them into your personality, you can just go crazy after that. But there's, there's no way that you can say, I'm gonna start off Mixing real basketball like I did with me versus me. I tried to do that and it, it just didn't work I fell flat on my face. I was mixing real basketball with with uh, With the game going against myself my career and whatever and it just didn't work out because I hadn't pulled enough people in to my Personality yet conversely in 2k 17 once I got everybody pulled in doing all the video You know what I'm saying? I was doing all the the meta videos the bass videos all that stuff I got enough people pulled in and they was like yo, you really are a funny dude then when we started doing Raging with Randoms, it started going crazy. And I stopped doing Raging with Randoms because it was just bad for my nerves. But you know, it is what it is. But y'all understand what I'm saying. Love, hey, last one we got for y'all, man. Hey, Swante, like, Cod is so worried about matchmaking. Um, you versus certain people on your skill level over a lobby with a decent connection. This stuff is sad. Bro, I say it's always been like this. That's why we hate skill-based matchmaking. People be like, skill-based matchmaking is just pick on people your own. Nah, it's pick on pick on them at your own size and then you probably not gonna be able to kill them because they're gonna be they're gonna be somewhere in, in, in West Hell somewhere and you're not gonna be able to shoot them. And that's why those people are up there. A lot of people are up there because their connections are complete and utter shit. One dude was like, I'm on a one megabit connection and I'm out here killing everybody and y'all probably got one ping and fiber internet and y'all, Shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! Don't you know that back when we had fiber in the beginning, when Sandy Ravis had fiber internet and nobody else had it, he could kill literally everybody and nobody could kill him because his packets reached you before they reached it. And then you know what Activision did? They went back and they ratcheted it. The doggone lag come up to nine million. So now, if I play with people from other countries, I play with my boy Jojus, I play with people with trash connections, guess what? They have an undecided advantage over people. That's why people be using VPNs. That's why people be using, um, using the 
uh, net doom and stuff to limit their connection so that they can sit they can sit there and just trash people because those packets will never make it to them. But that you know my packets always make it out, but they packets never make it to me. Now I'm going over a lot of people here, but y'all understand what I'm saying. Last but not least, if you got a wife, you know this scene right here. Lady Quay said, "Hey, I was only supposed to pick up a few items, and this happened. Uh, this happened. <laughs> this is what happened when you uh when you take your boy." with you and i said bro this happens to me whether my wife take me or not and if i go by myself that's happened too man you don't never who, who ever go to walmart and, and say i'm only gonna pick up a few items and actually stick to it i can't do it man i failed that test just like i failed no that november i'm not gonna lie to y'all man y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section though man is after bat that strong is it one of those badges that you got to have do you use it and also like the video for your chance to win 50 dollars like the video for your chance to win a playstation laptop uh, $50, I mean $500, or um, or Xbox or something like that. And uh, y'all just keep grinding, man. Do your thing, and I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Channel. Guys, please.